Each eye should be a sister, not a twin. So, well, my cousins. Queens is a web-based series for young women of color, showing them successful, interesting, amazing black women who are killing the STEM game. Today, as our guest, we have Miss Fig O'Reilly. She is the first black Miss Universe Ireland. She's a NASA data knot and now a correspondent on Mission Unstoppable. Welcome, Fig. Thanks for having me, Jatia. I'm super excited. Now tell me, where did you grow up and where do you live now? I've grown up all over the world and uh, now I split my time between Dublin, which is where I am now, and Washington, DC. What was your favorite place that you've ever lived? Living in Italy, I got scouted. I moved to Milan and I started working full time. I saw you. Oh, this is big. Every time we have a guest on, we always get the rundown and their opinions in a segment that I have named, Oh Really? With <laughs> O'Reilly. <laughs> I love it, let's do it. You tell us about your name and how to pronounce it. My real name is Finula. It's an Irish name and it's spelled F-I-O-N-N-G-H-U-A-L-A. <laughs> What was the last song you listened to? Megan The Stallion, Body. Oh, body, yaddy, 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 body crazy. How are you making me? You know what? My, my knees are all right. You know, okay. my knees are right. My, my knees are like my shoulders. They can do a little something, something. <laughs> we are kicking it into high gear with O'Reilly, with O'Reilly, with our lightning round. So you got choices and you have to pick. Question number one. Rihanna or Beyonce? Beyonce! You are American, you're also Irish. So, soccer or football? Football, just because I feel like, you know, there's an entire event around the game. Right. Megan Thee Stallion or Cardi B? Probably listened to Cardi B's debut album on repeat a thousand times. However, Megan Thee Stallion has come out of the gate super strong. And I've actually met Megan the Stallion and she was super nice to me. So I'm probably gonna have to go with her. Last question in our lightning round, dancing or singing? You can only do one. What do you do? Dancing. I okay. sound like a dead animal singing. So dancing all the way because you can all just- All right, well, let me just scratch out the segment about singing then, all right. In our segment called STEM royalty. Are you a sovereign of science, a sovereign of tech? Are you an engineering empress or a marchioness of math? Piece of me is in each one because I get to communicate science on Mission Unstoppable. I studied systems engineering and my favorite subject growing up in school was math, but tech for me is where it's at. How did you start loving tech? I went to a summer math and science honors academy. Um, it's called SMASH, SMASH Academy for inner city students in the Bay Area for students that come from low income families. First time in my life, I was around other kids that were good at these subjects and we all kind of liked these subjects. So it wasn't nerdy. So every summer I spent at UC Berkeley on campus, uh, living with these students. I made such great friends and I was studying nothing but science, technology, engineering, and math. That was the place where I really found out what, an, what it means to be an engineer. Cause I really didn't know when I was 15 years old. I didn't have parents that were engineers. And, you know, I never met a woman that worked in STEM. And at the end of my high school career, I knew that I wanted to be an engineer going to show us a little of her personality and special talent in our segment called Queen Ting. For our winged liner look, you need just a couple of tools. You need okay. liquid liner. Uh, you need maybe um, a brush like this. Burgundies are a great color for women of color. Um, for brown skin because it does give a pop of color. So I'm gonna use this one. So I find like the middle of my eyelid and I kind of go in like half moon, like a half moon shape. You can see here, I've, I've kind of got one going. Essentially what I do is I create the wing first. Like I actually don't wing, wing out this way. 
I wing it out more like this way, like towards my eyebrow. So once I got that line going, mm -hmm. connect the line to my eye. Very can I? Yeah, and then I go and I fill in the color. All about the angles, right? So mm -hmm. after that, I go and kind of connect everything a little more smoothly on top. So then you find the center of your eye, mm -hmm. and then you kind of bring bring it out, connect it, it out, yeah, bring it out, connect it. Just a few shades darker. I'm going to use that color and actually go underneath my eye with that color. Here comes the smoke. Here comes the smoke. And you just want to blend it in a little. Oh, yeah. Yes. Ooh. We got a Ooh. nice dual smoke going. We got our smoky eye going on. So, I mean, like, the next step is definitely to smile, right? There's this trick where I think that it's, first you have to smile and then lift your eyebrows and then stop smiling. I just looked surprised. Oh, whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> oh my. <laughs> oh my God, that is like, see, that's why they pay you the big bucks. That's why they pay you the big bucks. <laughs> you got professional level smile. <laughs> Great to have you. I've got my smoky eye and we've learned a little bit more about you. So thank you so much. Anything you want to say to the young ladies out there watching before we go? Be fearless and pursue your dreams. Go after your goals. There should be nothing that stops you from doing the things that you want to do. Thank you so much. And let's give them a pageant wave or... <laughs> thank you so much. Yay. Thanks, Vic. It's gonna kind of create a tease. Yes, exactly. So already, the, the goal is to standing in a perfect pageant pose. You can leave your arms down, or you can put your hands on your, your waist, actually, probably a little higher. Yes, there you Hello. go. Hello. 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 My name is Jatia Hart, and I am representing engineering.